channel how you all doing thank you for stopping by again today thank you for clicking on this video if it's your first time seeing my face please click on the subscribe button and join my family and to my ever returning subscribers thank you so much for coming back so guys it's six past six this morning and i told you guys i'm going to be updating you guys where i have chosen to actually give birth and you know the higgy haga of giving birth in general hospital is not a joke <laughs> so first off we are i think we just eased our um, it's not totally eased because we're still partially in lockdown so i'm going this early morning this past six to go get number these days they don't like <laughs> normally my husband normally goes to get number and all of a sudden they just you know stopped all of that so you as the pregnant woman you have to come and you know get your number by yourself so that is one thing about the general hospital because it's not a joke when you want to give birth you have to follow rules and regulation unlike my private hospital in, in another city where i can go at any time you know and get anything checked so i actually filmed some videos yeah the first time i went to the general hospital I actually filmed so i might be inserting some clips here and there in this video and also updating you guys so guys from the title of the video you already know what the video is all about but i just wanted to put it out here that i'm going to general hospital today to register get my name on the system and all of those good stuff because the lockdown still continues and my hospital is in Levkosha, is in another city and we are not allowed to like move from one city to another so i just want to be on a safer side and um yeah i'm going right now um i'm going to be telling you guys the process of you you know whatever process i have to go through today i'm going to tell you but what i know is that my husband actually went very early as early as um six yeah he went as early as past six he has gone to the hospital to get us a number you need to get a slot so that you don't go there a lot of people are there so we've gotten a slot and um I'm going right now. I'm going to be updating you guys. So if you're in North Cyprus and you want to use the general hospital, I'm just going to be telling you guys all I get to do today because I'm not sure we are we are supposed to film. But if I get to film little of anything, I'm going to still put it into this vlog. But anyways, I just wanted to carry you guys along and uh, yeah, I hope everyone is doing well. Let's go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video on everything normally i know a lot of you ask what it entails to like give birth in the general hospital over here if you have your documents i don't think you get to pay any money i don't think so or you just pay for the room or i will still be updating as time goes but i wanted to carry you guys along this morning tell you guys that i have decided to actually you know bet my baby in the general hospital yes and if there's any other update i'm going to still be putting it here as i said i'm going to be putting in the clip of the first day the first time i actually went there the medicine that was given to me though i'm not a, a doctor so if you want that medicine you have to get doctor's report yeah so that is it guys so guys we are here my, my son is also taking his immunization today and funny enough he knows he knows that he's taking his own, so my husband will take him while my husband will take him there while I go to my to, to see the to see the doctor. Yeah. hi guys so i'm back home after so many hours later hmm. so i just wanted to come in here and give updates because sorry i forgot this i wanted to come in here and give you guys some updates like some information that you'll be needing 
yeah so i went you have to have patience when going to the general hospital you just have to have a lot of patience you understand so yeah i've done that i've gotten this card this card this is the card that you get in the hospital yeah i've gotten it and i've registered basically so if anything if this covid thing still continues then who at this point because she was even asking me that do i will still want to make use of the dry hospital or do i want to give birth here i said i gave birth in the general hospital. so for those who do not know i actually gave birth to my first my son in the general hospital here in guinea so yeah it took a while for the doctor to come but when the doctor came here they saw me they said my baby is big <laughs> and that's baby i don't know you know this wise they are not used to big babies i was like yeah because my my baby this one actually weighed 4.2 at birth so yes i have big babies but yeah so i was the medicine that i know she diagnosed this medicine for me yeah it's a blood medicine so i'm going to be using i'm sorry yeah i'm going to be taking this medicine now it's a blood tablet yeah it's around 37 36 36 for something yeah so i'm going to take it i got two she said i should get two packs so i got it so what else what update again do i want to give yeah she said my baby is big you know one thing about doctors like over here they are not used to big babies when i told her that my baby was weighing 4.2 the other baby she was like wow baby is big and all of that she wanted to scare me but i said you can't you, you, you can't scare me but anyways yes that is what i wanted to put out here yeah and yes i'm going to be doing um our gender review will be coming I had a surprise baby shower which i'm going to be just seeing you guys very soon about that everything but i'm going to be doing like a gender review on my channel very soon because right now it's very very clear anywhere you go to the gender is very clear right now so i'm going to be doing a gender review i hope i'm not forgetting anything because i just wanted to make an update on this video I hope i'm not forgetting anything yes so basically that's just it okay yeah tomorrow i'm going to go do my blood my sugar test yes so i'm going to go do my sugar test that test takes around four hours it takes time so i'm going to go do that and i know that everything will be very smooth so i'm going ahead to go take care of my baby yeah and yes guys if you have any question concerning all this my pregnancy journey please let me know in the comment section i'm heading home we're almost there we're almost at the hospital i'll be showing you guys how we queue hopefully i get to just you know show you hopefully i get to show you guys how we kill this morning you come according to how you get number according to how you come and all of those good stuff thank you guys so much for all the love i'm getting in my previous video i'm super grateful to each and every one of you please share my videos as i always say and yeah let's go to the hospital and let's go and see how it's going to look like this morning wish me well in the comment section bye guys
guys we're done and yeah i'm number eight funny thing is guys during this period i think they only attend to 10 persons per day correct me if i'm wrong but i think so and also um what else am i forgetting so i'm number eight yeah you can see the queue guys i must have put the clips the queue is something else <laughs> i'm going home right now because the doctor comes at nine so it's best you get your number and i'll be coming back by nine to see the doctor whatever update i have to give to you guys i'm still going to give you guys on this um vlog yes yeah, so i wanted to just come in here and just people that are curious giving birth in the government hospital how it's like and everything don't worry i'm carrying you guys along in this particular one and i hope you enjoyed this vlog i know you will enjoy it yes guys i will talk to you guys when i'm back to the hospital to see the doctor and all of those good stuff see you guys later Nobu say hi. You can see the struggle, guys. My whole family. Babe, say hi. Hi. <laughs> Everybody, you can see the way we are looking. We woke up very, very early. It's not easy, but we're gonna do what we're gonna do. All right, later, guys. So, guys, I'm heading back to the hospital. It's nine. It's nine already. So, I'm going to talk to you guys when I come out of it. Wish me luck. Bye guys. So guys, I'm back home and yeah. What's the time? So I don't even know, but it should still be around eleven or thereabouts. Yes. Preparing. And I told you guys I'm going to be giving birth in that hospital, in the general hospital. So the only thing about the general hospital is you need to go as early as possible. Right now you need to go very early as six, six thirty to pick up a number because the door actually opens they start giving number at 7 a.m so you need to go at 6 a.m or 6 30 a.m and you get your number yeah then you queue up if you're someone that does not have a lot of patients then the government hospital is not for you but if, if you're someone that have lots of patients then you have to you know you have to go there so if you have any inquiry you can also go there and ask them or you can drop your comments in the comment section whichever one i can answer i'm going to be answering it yes guys i'm going to still be updating you guys you're going to still see a lot of um updates of how i you know putting to bed in the general hospital and all of that good stuff yes guys i've not eaten since morning i want to go eat yeah i just wanted to end this vlog because i I have not talked to you guys and yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll definitely see you guys in my next video bye guys